What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're going to do some standard action today on MTG Arena, which is what all the kids are doing. And uh, this is a captive audience deck that was submitted by Josh, Josh VS. It has three captive audiences. Under the control of your opponent, they gain it. At the beginning of your upkeep, choose one that hasn't been chosen. Uh, your life total becomes four. Discard your hand. Each opponent creates five 2 2 black zombies. And. Uh, yeah, those are all pretty good. And then you have emergency powers, which is pretty sweet. So you can actually emergency powers and then hopefully hit one of the captive audiences and play it for free. 26 lands of varying colors. Uh, Eldest Reborn of three, Mirari Conjecture, two Ral, two Ritual of Soot, four Chemistry's Insight, three Bedevil, four Absorb, which is, these casting costs are pretty funny here. Uh, we're hoping we have enough white sources for the Absorbs. We didn't actually tweak the, the mana base that much in order to accommodate for absorb here um but we'll see we have one two three four five we only have six white sources which might be a bit low how many black sources do we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen hmm. okay well i wanted to add one of those i don't know how to do that from this screen. So we'll add one of those, and we'll probably add one more Hollowed Fountain for one Steam Vents, or maybe one Godless Shrine. So I don't know how to do it here, so I'm actually gonna take out one, we'll add one Godless Shrine. And we'll take out one of the Steam Vents. Uh, I think Ionize is fine. I think in a deck like this, you're going to want to gain life more than deal damage. I mean, I mean, like, the thing is, like, Ionize shouldn't really matter. Here's the problem. Let's look at Ionize. I think Ionize is a fine card, but if, we're, if our goal is to play Captive Audience and put their life total to four, any damage that is dealt before that point does nothing. So we can be like, here, take two, take two, take three, take five. What do you got, 12? All right, here's a Captive Audience. Your life total goes to four. And then there's no point in dealing any damage whatsoever before that point. So there's really no reason to play Ionize at any point. Yeah, there's no, there's no way we're going to play double white cards in this deck. Anyway, so we have one Sinister Sabotage, four Absorb, three Bedevil, four Chemistry's Insight, two Ritual of Soot, two Mirari Conjecture, which is nice because we can get back our Bedevil, our Absorb, our Ritual of Soot, things like that. Um, Eldest Reborn is great. Emergency Powers would be nice to copy. Maybe, probably not. That doesn't do anything. And one Syncopate and two Banefire. So... I'm excited. Let's see how it goes. And as before anyone asks, we're not going to be playing ranked because ranked is best of one. I don't think they made best of three, right? What's ranked and traditional ranked? Can someone tell me the difference between these two? Because it doesn't actually explain it to me on Magic the Gathering on, on MTG Arena here. It doesn't actually say what the difference is. The overlay for Twitch should be there. The Deckmaster overlay should be on. Ranked best of one, traditional rank best of three. Oh, maybe we just, just do traditional rank then. Or, so what do you guys want to do? You guys want to do traditional ranked or do you guys want to do uh, traditional constructed where we actually play an event? I'll leave it up to you guys. Traditional or ranked or just a, a, an event. Let's do ranked. Ranked doesn't commit us to the deck, so it's more like the style we do on Magic Online, where we play a match, we can tweak it a little bit. Can you stop? Can you type? Can we type in English in the chat? Because I really don't want to have to translate all these things, or or ban you for not speaking in English. Because I just, I just, it's not, it's not enjoyable. It's a cute meme, but. Yep, and it says something. Oh, nope, that's not what we wanted to do. Uh, ban. All right. Wrong one. 
Yep, and now you're done. I've been playing Arena for quite a while. No, all I play is Mario Captain America, I believe, and still does well, so I don't really fret. Yeah, I'll. All right, so no plays so far. We have like six counter spells in the deck. We have not drawn one yet, so we'll just play this tapped. Well, I made them a mod because I clicked on the wrong button. And then I... It was it was either mod or ban. They wrote three-letter words. And I was like, let me just click the, the one, the, the shortest word on here, and that'll do it. I was starting through old clips, and the only that clip was so funny. I agree with you. That clip is fantastic. Oh, that's what we're, that's what we're looking for. 26 lands in the deck. I hope we don't run out of lands. Oh, Arena is for brainless plebs. Wow. <laughs> That's so fantastic. Oh, good times. I don't enjoy a thing, so I will make fun of the people who do enjoy that thing. I was going to Lava Cola this guy, but I think Eldest Reborn is just fine here. It's nice to get an Eldest Reborn down and just get this guy back when we're done. Yeah, the dad clip did win that that bracket, which is understandable because I just lost it, man. Also, this is uh, Mike usually leaves work at around 315 and he's still here. So this is the second Monday in a row where he just hasn't gone to work. So again, if you guys are over here for my... Mike job concerns. This is just a uh, just another one. Mm. Yeah, you missed someone getting getting banned. Uh, cool. Free crads, my dudes. I feel like we're way ahead right now, just to be clear. A ban and a timeout. One brainless pleb buck. Nice. Nice. Wow, they had to they had to lava coil their own their own Drake. God, times are tough. I really have no interest in like There's none of these cards are any good right now, which is funny. But I don't think this deck has any kind of inevitability against us, right? We have Lava Coils for their Phoenixes if they play those. We have ways to kill all of their creatures. Like, they've run like eight creatures. We've already gotten rid of one, two, three, four, five, six, if they have Enigma Drakes. I'm not supposed to be drunk as I'm at work. What does that mean? Man, chat is the Wild West today. People are just going crazy.
One, two, three. One, two, three, four. All right, this is good. Oh, boy. Our deck is killing it. I exist in a superposition of drunk and not drunk. Yeah, you're like a, you're like a particle. You know what? That's fine. It doesn't draw you a card. I'm good. Um, nope. This one. This one. This one. And this one. All right. I think I double spell pierce this. Mm, I paid the two. Weird spell pierce flex, but okay. Beans and cornbread, beans and cornbread. What are you going to sacrifice? I see. I see. Burp, burp, burp. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have nine mana. We can do everything. Can't be countered. Let's not counter it. I guess we'll pass. We don't have enough. Oh, we do. We have red, black, black. We can. Yeah, you can draw your card. Excuse me. Would have liked to saved Eldest Reborn for this guy. I am flexing. I'm flexing on this Drake nerd right now. CTB, thank you for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Welcome back. What are you? What are you thinking about? You just draw your card and you let the turn go. We're done here. What what problem is? Didn't think about that right click and seed, am I right? <laughs> you might be right. You very well might be. Well, they used the timeout. I don't know why. He's thinking about how he used to call him on his cell phone. Yeah, probably. And they just lose the card. Oh, and we get a Niv Mizzet back when this thing pops. Whoo! You guys heard that, right? You did not hear that. Hmm. Why isn't that coming through? That's really weird. I think we figured it out last time, but now I'm wondering. Urk, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. I made it back for another. I really appreciate it. So we have one instant and no sorceries in the Grave Yard. I'm going to put some Grave Ring. All right, it's not actually doing anything here. We got it. All right, we did it. So against the Drake deck, they probably have no answers to an Ixalan's Binding, right? Huh. 
hollowed fountains. I think it's actually fine. We can just do it like this. What flavor of Mio is that? <laughs> oh, God. None of these are coming through. I don't know why. You heard it because it's coming through the speaker. You're, you're hearing what I'm hearing. Like it's coming through the speakers and hitting at the mic. So it's not actually coming through on the desktop audio. You're just hearing what I'm hearing as it comes through the mic. I'm trying to figure out why they're not... Uh... Um... Blue, blue, white. Yeah, this is fine. Search was a good draw there. I'll spell pierce your search for Escanta. Go ahead, you're not gonna not do it. There you go, you did it. Good for you. I'm about to bust. Okay, that time it worked. That was me when I was able to get back in Niv Mizzet. Oh, I'm about to bust. Arena is like a Fisher Price baby toy interface for a thinking man's game. I think the only people who say that are the people who are really uh, self conscious. <laughs> like, <laughs> who are really trying to overcompensate for their own intellectuality. I, I think it's just fine. And uh, I, I think you'll be okay. Goodbye, little Drake. That's exciting. So we can actually bedevil this guy, still keep up absorb. Yeah, this game's over, right? Oh god. So edgy, dude. So edgy. Glad you banned him because god, people like that are just miserable. God, go be miserable somewhere else, man. I have to use words like retarded and minorities and women every I'm I'm the I'm the most angry white man on the internet you guys will never understand my struggle god just go dude no consent is also a messed up name to have holy crap dude <laughs> what a what an awkward rapey name oh god I don't know why I switched to a New York accent. It just kind of happened. It just kind of morphed into that. Anyway. I, I like people who, like, who when they go somewhere or when they interact with a group of people, they make things worse rather than better. Like, I think wherever you go, 
you should try to make things better than they, than they were before you were there. So it's really fascinating to me when people are literally deliberately making things worse than they were. I don't want to run a captive audience into uh, four untapped lands when they have four cards. I mean, if that person wants to make a new account just to come into my specific stream, like, dude, you have bigger problems than I do. So, you know, knock yourself out. I have dealt more damage with their drakes than they have. Like, if you walk into a place, into a conversation, into a building, into a group of people, anything, no matter what you what you inject yourself into, make sure it's better. You Make sure you help make it better than it was before you got there. If you get there and it's worse than it was prior to your arrival, just really consider what you're doing, I think. Alan, I got nothing clever. Why does it say it doesn't even say it doesn't even say how many months there? But it's probably like fifty. Oh, today's kind of got thirty-eight. Thirty-eight subs today. That doesn't seem correct, but you know. So we can play this untapped and still play around. We can still play around Spell Pierce here. Oh, Biscuits. Alright, that's fine. If we draw another land now, we can not only play around Spell Pierce, we can absorb as well, so. Two captive audiences, what kind of spice did I walk into? The most captive of spices. I'd like one cent a month, please. Well, that's... I feel like if I give you that, then the... the, the theory, I feel like the, uh, the... The benefit of you subscribing is really gone for me at that point. That is weird that you would change your accent to theirs, because it's almost... That's almost insulting, right? Like... We're going to play this now because uh, if they want a Disdainful Stroke, we can single bait for one. That's not going to do it, but maybe. If they have Spell Pierce, we can... God dang it! Biscuits! Oh, well. This is why I didn't want to... This is why I didn't want to do these things, but... We could have waited, but I didn't think they'd have two Disdainful Strokes. They had two disdainful strokes. I mean, if they play any other creature, we have Eldest Reborn and Absorb, so. I hope they go. Well, they can't even, like. They only have two red, let alone three for a Niv Mizzet. <coughs> I feel so bad. And I got called out, and I'm like, I just want to be part of the in crowd, man. <laughs> yeah, now if we played. Now if we played our captive audience, we could absorb as well, but. This one Drake is going to go the distance, man. You got it. I wish I, I wish it, because it's their Drake that it counted. It should say it has, uh, its power and toughness equal to the number of instant and sorcery cards in its owner's graveyard and in exile. Wouldn't that be sweet? So then if you steal it, it still keeps its same toughness, or its same power, rather. This is a lot of lands, but, you know, our hand is good. Despite that. I don't think there's a reason to not hold lands other than, like, Chemister's Insight. But I'd still rather be able to maximize the things I can do, especially with Syncopate in hand. 
Oh, this is a lot of islands and not a lot of red sources. Okay, that guy's pretty good. This belongs in a museum. I feel like Rel has Indiana Jones voice. So do you! They're trying to figure out which counter spell they want to use. They're like, I can get rid of this. I just want to know which one I'm going to use. Uh, let's pay one. And look, my deck did not keep up absorb mana. Fantastic. God, that's fantastic. Guess we're taking two here. Ugh, God. You got Absorb in hand? Eh, don't worry about it. Then was that your Indiana voice? Uh, maybe? Depends on how bad you think it was. If it was terrible, then no, of course not. If you liked it, yeah, it was. That was it. Uh, it's okay, we gained some of that life back. Oh, they're just dead then. I'm gonna do cool stuff before I kill them, because they don't know. I just named 10. Could have been 11. Could have done it for 11. What about your Henry Jones Jr. voice? We named the dog Indiana. I love that dog. What are we changing about this deck? Nothing? Opponent has two red. See? Opponent has two red. Nobody cares. I always want to open packs in the middle of my things. cool that's really frustrating because you're buying packs with the hope of a rare and you never get a rare right like if i have all the rares from the set like i just get nothing can i get a rare from a different set or like a while i don't get it it's such a sh it's it's a i'll be honest it's kind of a it's kind of a shitty compromise do we want to change anything i like the mana base there i like the i like the eldest reborns um bedevil and absorber great the mana worked that game. I think we I think we have to we didn't see any flaws in that particular game. So, we'll keep going. WTF is a gems. <laughs> Same. It's a Cadbury candy where I come from, like a budget version of M&M. Yeah, the Cadbury gems. I'm a big fan of Sixlets. I don't know if you guys know those candies. Those are from Canada. The gems are not awful, but like 20 gems for a rare is pretty bad because you don't get another, you don't get a rare. Right? So like, what would I rather have over gems? A rare wild card so I can get, hey, listen, you spent all this time and effort collecting every rare in this set. You literally have four of every rare in this set. So, can I get a different rare from a different set that I need? Because I don't get a rare. And I can't trade 20 gems for a rare. So it's like... I don't know. It doesn't it just doesn't make any sense to me. I'll keep this in. I feel like we we're just a basic Demir deck splashing for white cards and red cards. Oh, look. We're playing... We're bronze and we're playing the silver player? God. At least I think that's silver. Sure. Submerged Boneyard, huh? Uh, I want to put this in Graveyard because you know red.
Yeah, but you don't have to have all the rares in one set. You can get you can use a wild card for anything, right? Like a future set. You can use it for previous sets. Like there's tons of like M19 cards I don't have. And I would love to get them. But 20 gems just doesn't do anything. 20 is just not a lot, right? Uh, graveyard. Where my red man is at? Kill them all. That was pretty good. The problem is you're opening a pack that's guaranteed to have a rare in it, and it doesn't have a rare in it. Right? So, like, you, I want something comparable to a rare. I mean, I feel like I'm almost being penalized for having all the rares in the set. Why waste the money on the arena? What does that mean? Uh, library. So Ral starts it with five and he goes down to two, so it dies to both of these. And if we plus it, he dies to both of these. And we play to land. So we know they have two lands in hand. I guess we're just gonna kill one. Oh, uh, we are current Emerson. We are currently 1-0, so we are undefeated. Seems good. Oh yeah, that's a card, all right. That is a card. Uh Got a graveyard, this guy. We just don't we're not we're not there yet. Well, that would have been nice previously. This is what's known as a yikes from me, dog. Oh, well. I don't actually hate that. Come on, Eldest Reborn off the top. Oh, biscuits. One, two, three, four, five. Why are you like tapping all the white sources? That's weird to me. Time to choose. There it is. Yep. That is a sad. God, Carnage Siren's a hell of a drug. Okay, so I'm going to take out the Marari Conjecture. It seems a little slow. Bring in two of these guys. Take out the take out two Quenches. I'll bring in two more of these guys. Definitely Claren also seems better than like one Bedevil. Because it kills most of their guys. <clears throat> I think that's probably fine. Syncopate's also. Alright, we'll board in like this. Um, I'm pretty sure we don't need play crafters. We have literally four. Uh, four consecrate consume, which is just fine. And it always makes them sack the, the the biggest guy, not the not just a random small tiny guy. Oh, keep it. 
it's okay if we can hit a white source, so. That's a white source. Man, we have black, black, red. We have blue, blue, white. <laughs> Basically have it all. Pilot Evan, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Oh, this is nice. Sulfur, no damage. We have steam vents next turn with no damage. Or we can chemistry's inside, I guess. Yes, we are a month ahead on the rent, which is nice. Submerged Boneyard follow-up, perhaps? Oh, just an overgrown tomb bay. Tomb bay! We could just enter this tapped. I think we want a chemistry's insight though. We want to hit lands. And I don't think killing a land of war elf is really where we want to be. Yeah, whenever you have all the shock lands in standard, it's always very, very good times. Especially when they're combined with the, uh, I guess they're called check lands. I don't know. These guys. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. But I will, because I'm going to be chemistry's insighting. Absorb just says you can play one and a half shock lands for free. How many shock lands? I think like eight. That's a guess off the top of my head. You can check the overlay on the screen. Get a more uh, detailed answer. How many have we got in here? Two, huh? Okay. So we can't kill this. We can kill you, but then Ral would die. Rally Zally would die. I guess we can just plus Ral here. Yeah, we can just plus Ral. Should I start up a Cayman Islands Streamlabs competitor so all your donations go into a secret Cayman Islands bank account? Yeah, probably. If you can do it, if you have the, the, the resources to do that, then... Wow, we get to draw a card and get a land? Lava Coils, nice. Sinister Sabotage is probably not. We're just going to Banefire kill Karn next turn. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I'd rather just have a counter spell here. Beasts are much more reliable. You can't stop nature. Well, I'd sure like to try. One, two, three, four, one, two. Yeah. So six, we actually take two here, kill this. They play Karn. We can Ritual of Soot and Eldest Reborn. One, two, three, four, one, two. Yeah, we're one shot from that too. But the problem is, like, we're just not going to let Vivian Reed hang out. Let's do this again. This, this chat is boring. No one's been banned for like 15 minutes. Biscuits. Meet my newest friend. Okay, well. Sure.
Okay, so one, two, three, four, and then we're gonna keep up Sinister Sabotage here. We could also just play, we're gonna play Swamp here and keep up uh, Chemister's Insight as well. They can go land and then play this for six, draw two. It's pretty good. The wilds are we want to keep up any. We want to keep any second thing off the board so that they we can play Elder Stormborn next turn and get this Vivian read. Double Crassus seems good. Wooded Foothills into Crassus for two. I imagine you're going to draw the card still, but we don't get it on the board, which is nice. So then you have to sack Vivianos McReadums. Yep, don't need that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We don't need a tenth land. You got it. Chemistry's inside is nice having this many lands. Sea Monk, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. the captive audience next turn which is pretty sweet Let us begin. Well chosen. you can have branchy boy does life suck nothing but bad luck for you try frank brand buttery biscuits they're not that great but you got nothing else going on that's actually yeah all that's true i uh can't even disagree with that they ain't that great, but what do you really have going on? Oh, can I cancel this? Nope. Okay, well, enter's tapped, I guess. I would have loved to kept that in hand to discard or whatever, but... Let's get five one ones. Five two twos. There they are. There's your boys. Here we go. Uh, all subs get a pig after three months. The yellow pig. It's all. It's all upgraded. It doesn't matter how the sub has how the sub happened. It just matters that it happened. Assassin's trophy and leave that bad boy on the tippity top. This is gonna pop off, right? <clears throat> and we can get a Vivian Reed. Oh boy. Oh boy. Do you have another card you can play? Because we're actually just going to kill this car, my dude. <coughs> Half their life from four to two? That's not... This is the other... This That's not what this one does. This is target player sacks a creature with the greatest power. This is for Carnage Tyrant. Alright, we'll pass. We'll pass again. My turn. My turn. Okay, so it's not just your graveyard. Oh, we can also get a Ral. Ral kills one of your creatures, which is nice, I believe. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's good. And they don't have five mana up, right? So they're going to have to either <clears throat> go to four or discard their hand. I don't think they're discarding their hand, so they're probably going to four. Yikes. All right, well, our board's pretty good for them being at four. Okay, so they gain what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So they gain two? Yeah, 
That's what's known as a yikes for me, dude. I think they're dead. They lose all the cards they just drew. That's pretty cool. Wow, really? Aren't you... Oh. Alright. I just show you nothing? That was a weird choice to attack there, but... Weird flex, but okay. Got him. All right. <clears throat> well, that's good. Thanks for going to four and giving me five, uh, five dose doses. I think even if we lose this match, I'm still okay with it. Alrighty then. Oh, we got the emergency powers. I'm actually scared of giving this deck seven cards. Meh, alright. You got it. Update on Mike Lee Fork has not done so, nor has he responded to our group chat yet, so he's likely still sleeping. Like you do. At 5 p.m. Is a gateway plaza? Fascinating. That boy does need. Oh man, boot camp. He has no discipline whatsoever. Cast down? Buddy, I have no creatures in this deck. Oh, I guess they got rid of it. That's sad. I, rather, I would have rather you keep it. My problem with Dragon Skull Summit is it doesn't cast Absorb. I went to bed at 7.30 and still woke up at 1.30 must go. He, he, yeah, well, no, I don't think he even does that. He goes to bed like 7. He said between 4 and 5 is when he goes to bed, but I don't think that's true. What do they have? Can we set up a voice my server if we don't at 20? We can sound an air horn? That would be gas. That would be actual gasoline. So make sure this comes into play untapped. They have nothing here, and they went first, and they missed the land drop. This is all very good. I think twenty is a little high. You could probably do it for five. Every five dollar donation sets off an air horn. It would be gas. That's how air horns work. <laughs> Oh my god. I know I'll support this. <laughs> two air horns, my good sir. This is a two air horn donation. Ritual of Snooty Snoot Snoots. I'm just gonna keep passing here. I have no real incentive to play anything. Could have played Eldest Reborn there, actually. But, you know. We can wait. Oh, we could play Eldest Reborn and then get back our Ral. That's pretty cool. Should have done that. Fascinating.
Is this a, is this a, is this a counter spell mana? Are they like gonna negate us? Don't negate us. This is just a great two for one, dude. I'll take action on that all day. <clears throat> What's up, Casual Calamity? What's the nation to get Mike to stream with you dressed as a chinchilla? That's a good question. Oh, look at this. I love the Hydroid Crassus as a 2-2. It's like my favorite thing ever. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six, seven. Raise a gear. No, that's good enough. I don't want you to hit no free lands. I'm pretty sure they have five cards. This is such a good value for us. Sure. Wow. I hope you go land into Carnage Tyrant. That's what I want you to do. <coughs> Hydroid Crassis. That was our only emergency powers too, so I'm kind of sad. Especially because our hand is no bueno right now. We're gonna hold the land just because, uh... Well, that's a good reason. I feel better about holding this land. We could just exile a card to draw a card, but we could also make device the monitors asleep and reports on stream if he is sleeping. There are a few sleep monitors that have IOT hooks. What are IOT hooks? LOT hooks? And you could write a simple app that monitors it. Wow. Wow. Man, that disdainful stroke was really game break. Internet of Things. Huh. Is that true? I can't tell if that's true. Oh my god. I don't want to keep a black up because if we draw a devil, well, we only have one black anyway, but still, I still want to keep it up. No, we don't. We have we have a devil mana. Oh, that's pretty good. Or it, or rather, it will be. Oh, I like that I played that tapped, even though we could have uh, chemisters inside. We're not going to discard anything though. Next turn, our plan is to deafen and clear until Elders reborn, so. Or we can just captive audience. No one knows the wilds like I do. This is so many, so many of these little nerds. <sighs> I'm just gonna, uh, I guess I, uh, sure. Oh god, play them all. Re 
gay is a gator. Why do I keep saying that? I don't know. Uh, let's do one of these jobbies. Kill all your little turds. Hope you don't have another to stand. I do declare that this may be the most entertaining deck in standard. I am 100% on board with everything that is happening. Me too. So if we play this, we're going to have two up, which means if they syncopate for two. I'd like to have three up in case that is an option. I don't think it is. They're just going to disdainful stroke this, I'm sure, because they're very good at magic the gathering. They did not. <laughs> Vivian was on seven. Woo! I do declare that this may be the most entertaining deck in standard, you see. Oh, this is great because now we get a land so we can actually cast this, but we're not going to because reasons. Also, if they keep Assassin Strophing these and not this, like... Okay. I declare bankruptcy! Uh, Michael, you can't just yell bankruptcy. I didn't yell it, I declared it. Oh, because they control it. Yeah, you're right. That's a good point. That is a delectable point. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we can actually go 7 and 4, depending on what we draw. We can only use 7 keep that up. Blue, blue, white. Perfect. Let's do it. They're going to discard their hand because it's not great. But then what, they go to four life and we get five zombies? Yikes. Break me off a piece of that fancy feast. Oh, dang it. Why are the lands tiny and left? I don't know, man. I just work here. So they take away, we got four. We can't kill Liliana if we diff they did her. Veruliga. Why don't they activate her first? Did they? Oh, every time if it said enjoy the show, that would be gas. That's a that's a nice emote that they could do. All right, this guy will counter. They have one card left in hand. Because that actually trades a two. It, it makes a sacrifice one. Can't help you now. Oh, biscuits. Everybody get in. I'll be back. Just like before. Yeah, might as well gain the life, right? If you're gonna take it anyway, this is where they go Carnage Tyrant. Followed up with the Carnage Tyrant. Eh, four we have four zombies. Oh wow, sure. Braska's Contempt on a 2-2. Deal. Uh, Graveyard. And we will flip this. I guarantee you got the... Yeah, 100% transform. <clears throat> uh, let's... Activatio. Uh, Bedevil's nice. I'd rather just have a counterspell here. I think we just uh, took over. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, like, if they draw, like, Hydroid Crassus for four here, it's pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are one away. Now we attack with everybody because they lift this guy back, which means they want to block. So they are on the defensive. They have indicated that they are on the defensive. But interesting. I will pass. You got it. We're going to be consuming here, boys. <clears throat> It's Chemister's Insight. Discard a search for Azkanta. This deck is amazing. Josh, this might be your finest, your finest piece of work. Give me that 7-7 seven, seven life, my dudes. Actually, no attacks is fine. They're probably going to discard their hand because it's just one card. So, easy choice there. Hello, Consume! <laughs> It's like a little Jerry Seinfeld meme. It's not legendary, right? <laughs> hey, no attacks. End the turn, huh? Got a little captive audience here. Discard your hand again. Alright, those are no longer modes, my dude. I don't know why you wouldn't play the land if you... That's weird. Why would you hold that? Hmm. <laughs> you got me. Pretty sure we're playing the best deck in standard, but what do I know? So they block one to take 14 with two captive audiences on board. Looks like we may have them, you see. Go to 34. Seems good. An uncommon. It was an uncommon. I knew it. I'm very good at this game. Do you want to trade? Do you want to change anything? I still don't think I want to change anything, really. Um, I think the Hollow Fountains in the board are kind of funny. I, I kind of just want to take them out. I don't like lands and boards. Lands and boards and lands and boards and lands and... I almost want another emergency powers, I'm going to be honest with you. Over like a syncopate. Like five counter spells seems like a good amount. I don't know. Actually eight counter spells. I don't love quench. What about draft boys fun? We already did it. We literally did it today, dude. We got like only Elk Tears is coming because uh LaFuff can't make it. He just got it he's got booked for for some work, like on the exact on the exact time, same time. But uh yeah, we did three fifty and it was done within like twenty minutes. You guys are insane. <clears throat> I'm wondering if the Mirai Conjecture is great. Josh, any thoughts on the Mirai Conjecture being good or bad? I can see putting another Ritual of Soot in the sideboard.
What? No, just put it in the put it in the sideboard. Shut up and take my money. One lands and boards and lands and boards and lands and boards and lands and boards. <laughs> oh God. Conjecture seems. What's conjecture? Oh, Mirari conjecture. Gotcha. 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 Well, there is fight with fire on the sideboard, but like, I don't think those two need to be. I don't think they're necessarily like synonymous. Oh, I do like that. I do like it as as as, as more uh, emergency powers. I'm okay with that. I can get behind that then. I wouldn't mind putting one fight with fire in the main deck. Over like a quench, just because you do get a lot of lands in this deck. Quench is nice on two though. Am I still playing Moto? Yeah, I play Moto regularly. I play a Moto for Modern. I've done some drafts on Moto. Like I do some standard on Moto. Like I just happen to have this deck on on Arena, so we're doing it here. I, all the cubes will be on Moto, and I will. Hmm. I don't know what else to take out though. I'm not like. Man, I wish Coalition Relic was in this format, and not like not not Chromatic Lantern, the good one. I want to take the one Syncopate out. I'm not thrilled about Syncopate. I'm super stoked to join on the stream for the Captive Audience deck. Guy, I'm glad you're here. All right, we have two sideboard slots open. Maybe like two duress. We have a lot of sweepers, which is nice. We have Death and Clarion, Rituals of Soot. Maybe like two negates. I could see two negates being good. Lands and boards and lands and boards and lands and boards. Firemind's research in the board. That's fascinating. Let's get this dude out of here ASAP. We don't have a second black or a fourth land, so I don't want to guarantee Ritual of Soot, whereas that guy can be just huge on, like... Okay. We're in Kemmerster's Insight to guarantee we hit lands. I just hit two land drops. Seems good. Seems good. <clears throat> Come on, Black Source. We did it. Thank you. We're good at magic. Was totally not falling asleep at work until I saw the stream. Happy four months, my dude. Frank and the Barbados. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. <laughs> yep, that's rough. Yeah, modern is getting pretty pretty sizable. Oh, this is gonna be nice. Wildan, I've seen things that would break someone like you. Please. Girl, please. Got 
God, Eldest Reborn is such a busted magic card. You got Planeswalker? Alright, I'll kill it. We hit a land drop. I don't under I don't understand drop. Why don't we hit that land drop? We don't have any counter spells, so I think it's actually safe to chemistry's insight here and try to hit that land drop, and we did, boy. Alright, seems good. What do we get back? A Vivian Reed? That's pretty good. What do they got? A big old choops? <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, well, that is a dude. One, two, three, four, five. It's one, two, three, four, five, one, two, yikes. That, uh, this is what's known as a yikes for me, my dog. No one knows the wilds like I do. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven mana. Vivian doesn't do anything. It draws us a land every single turn. Shut up and take my money. I mean, it's literally a Phyrexian Arena, right? I mean, as opposed to like a creature, right? Like a one, two, or a two, three. Like that doesn't seem any better. One Boo Earns Book. Chugrin, thank you so much for the reset. 42 months in a row. Pretty sure it was my 36 month the other day, but okay. It might have been. It might have been. All right, we're gonna kill this guy. We're gonna play land tapped. We're gonna take a beat. Also, Liliana, the, the Eldest Reborn's third mode was literally draw a land, prevent seven damage, so. Oh, wow, they're just going face. Huh. That was a bold strategy. You would, I would have played that first, see if this resolves, and then if it doesn't, you can still kill Vivi, and now I just get to... Now I just get to Elder Shaborn your Carnage Tyrant? Wow, that's busted. Yeah, this is pretty, pretty broken. What are you getting back? Oh, wow, you should have waited for that too, my dude. <laughs> uh, let's... Vivian, I guess. You can't stop nature. Take a land. Keep getting lands. Okay, let's do it in such a way that we can keep up the devil. Actually, we can just ritual of sit all their things. Yeah. So we have black, black, red. Yeah, that works. Next, next, and the turn. All right. Resolve. Sorry. The next, I actually... I had to put in the next uh, the next tray of aligners last night, and they did not fit well at all. I want to get rid of this guy now so that they don't have uh... like I just don't want them to draw a million cards. So Fifteen ultimate at seven oh eight. All right, that's cool. Let's just keep hitting lands, guys. It, we just guarantee land drops every turn with Vivian Reed, pretty much. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What is this? Nine or ten? It's uh, nine. 
So we can Mirari Conjecture and then Fight with Fire their face. Yeah, I like Fight with Fire in the main deck because of this. It's just a nice kind of like, all right, sure. We can actually Chemister's Insight here to try to hit something. And we have Blue Blue White up. You know what? Sure. Let's get rid of the emergency powers at this point. I don't think we're going to be using that when they have two cards. Well, biscuits. I've seen things that would break someone like you. Well, that's aggressive. So we have one, two, three, four. So we can play Ral here. I never back down from a challenge. Ooh, let's see what we got. There we go. That's nice. I'll take that. This deck is insane. I'm I'm enjoying this deck a lot. Also, we just we can just get the Vivian Reed back. We could probably just get Carnage Ty Carnage Tyrant. We can just get the Carnage Tyrant. Thank you. I imagine you will keep fine finality on top. I imagine I will counter it. Got our first Meandies order. We'll be going back for more. Awesome. But thank you so much for saying so. Really appreciate it, buddy. Welcome back. Also, uh, Enemies MTGO, thank you for the resub. We got five on it. <laughs> Cyborg Huey and Penumbra, thank you guys for the resubs. Really appreciate them all. Let's keep an eye on our life total so we don't die. Oh, your Chronic Tyrant's gone. That's sad. Yeah, and if you guys are interested in some super soft micromodal underwear, be sure to check out meandies.com slash franklaport. You'll get 15% off, along with free shipping and free return arenos. Um, let's just get back Absorb here. And now we have one, two, three, four, five. We can actually lava coil this if we want to. I don't think we care, though. I want to peek. The weight is killing me. We kind of do. Because they're going to they're gonna Chupacabra this guy, so I don't want to take four here when we're at nine. I guess we can counter it, but I'd rather just counter, like, find finality, because that card is pretty busted. Yes, you may have that. So we just have to wait till this triggers, right? And then we then we fight with fire their face for a million. Let's get ritual of soot here. Oh, come on. I just want to peek. The weight is killing me. It's going to keep getting lands here. We have to discard town to 2, huh? We're gonna take seven. We have two counter spells. I think this is actually fine. Because next time we just win, right? <clears throat> One, two, three, four. <clears throat> yeah, so long as they don't gain life here. So we take seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we're gonna counter this. And then if they play fine finality, we counter that too. So pass. We actually prevent one here because we're gonna soak up two, but then we're gonna take one from the midnight reaper. So we get to draw a card. That's fine.
Got him. <laughs> if you were playing Zorro, would your title be Frank Lepore, Florida Man? Oh, that would be gas. Yeah, let's go with Frank Lepore, Florida Man. That's where we want to be. I'm going to take the quenches out. Take out... Take out one Marari Conjecture here. Um, bring in... This card just always needs to come in against the Carnage Tyrant. I guess we can bring in three. We still do have three Reldist Reborns. Did he say Reldist? Lob Coil is good. Search is good. Chemistry's Insight is good. Probably take out Banefire. We'll bring in Ritual and... I do like Deafening Clarion. Yeah, that seems okay. Water Grave into... Do they let us play first? Fascinating. Hold on one second, I should have... Anyway, hold on. I'll, I'll, like I was saying, I, I had the next level of aligners in last night, and they just didn't fit at all. So, like, I'm like, hey, these don't really fit. So I'm trying to, like, figure out what my next step is. It just sucks because I keep having these delays where, like, I'll get, like, five sets of aligners, six sets of aligners, and, like, they won't fit. And I'm just like, no. Okay, I have to go... You have to re remold them, and it takes like a month, and it's just a whole—it's a whole to do. So they get to take something here, but I think our hand is good enough to survive a duress, so. I'll deal with it. Boom, boom, boom. Just get rid of your teeth? Overrated. Sounds good. Sounds good. What do you think Watsi's angle is on the best of one, but not best of one, but random deck choice? What does that mean? Let's take our absorb. Sure. I have two sorcery speed removal spells here. A friend of mine is having get titanium teeth here. Titanium teeth? That's what I would call them. That would just be their name from now on. Oh, that's old titanium teeth. Well, if we actually get to get back a Jade Light Ranger... Actually, I don't think we get back anything. Did, didn't they? They took all their creatures back, didn't they? Oh, wow. That's sad. Yeah, this is pretty brutal. Not a fan of this. God, fine Finale gets back all of their options so we don't actually hit a land. I was hoping we were going to be able to hit a land. God. 
one shy. Oh god, if we had like one land, like a 26 land deck and we're missing land drops, it kind of sucks. But like any one land lets us play either both of those or this and this, so. I guess let's get to a point where they just don't have another creature. Hmm, another creature. We saw that coming. Spoiler alert, everyone did. So seven, eight, nine, ten. They kill this immediately, so it does nothing. They actually have to sack the Brontodon here, or else they have to sack their Carnage Tyrant, so. What if you have them fashion you two giant teeth, one for the top and one for the bottom? You know, I hadn't considered that. Are we dead? Let's figure it out. We are indeed dead. Like a horse? No, I think horses have multiple teeth. I think horses have rows and rows of teeth. Oh, God. Not rows and rows. They just have one row. One row of each. One top and one bottom row. It's not like... It's not like a tooth fiesta or anything like that. No blue mana. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is good. That's bad. Graveyard, unfortunately. Give me them lands. Two captive audience? That's good, too, actually. Well, we have two more cards, so the odds of us seeing a land in the next two cards gotta be gotta be a thousand to one, right? Graveyard. Top four no lands. Seems good. God, the things we do for lands. Wasn't there much headroom about not flossing and just wanting one long curvy tooth? I don't know, probably. If you came up with it right now, then probably. I feel like instead of quenching a third lava coil would be better. Library. Draw your two cards. Feel bad about our life choices. Merfolk Branch Walker? Jade Light Ranger? How did they ever run out of Jade Light Rangers? I've actually think I've cast like 19 Jade Light Rangers in this match against us. So now this guy is immediately out of Lava Coil range. Uh, I think we want we want lands. I mean, I hate to throw that away, but and we actually have to kill this, otherwise we take seven damage, which is not ideal. Kind of brutal. The lines we're forced to take here, it's pretty rough. I guess we get an extra land from this guy. Yep, that is what the seventh seventh Jade Light Ranger. Oh, God. We're having a good time. 
Five seven. That's a reasonable. That's a reasonable stat. Thankfully, we do get a search for us, Kanta. That's not bad. Although they do get to just run out Carnage Tyrant, right? No, they're not a Carnage Tyrant place. They don't have Carnage Tyrant in their hand. Fascinating. We're also at six life, so I'm not like, or nine life. We got a six. We got a six after this guy attacks. I feel like we're just pretty, uh, pretty dead here. Yep, figured you had that. I actually, I thought I knew you had that from you keeping it on top, and then it didn't show it. So that's pretty weird. Yep, game's over. Yeah, I think we want more Lava Coil just to be able to deal with early guys without having to, like... Like, if you're on the draw, and they go turn three Jade Light Ranger or something, and you don't have you don't have one of your two quenches, it's pretty rough. So let's... I actually don't like the quenches at all, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna add a little more Lava Coil. Actually, bring the syncope back. Yeah, I like that better. So we're 2 1 right now? Alright, let's see if we can 3 1 here. I'm excited about it. This deck seems sweet. I just want to be captive audiencing people. Also, being able to just discard your excess cards for, like, Chemister's Insight is nice. Yeah, I'll keep this hand. Who's Oarsman? Who is this? Is this Joe Lass Joe Lassette? This is a cool standard format so far. Shock. Seems good. No, we have nothing to do with our turn here, so I'm just going to play this tapped. You got it. Crazy game. It's my turn, right? Yeah, okay. Feels like we're dead. I mean, you're one, two, three lightning bolts and two shocks, so it's pretty good. Uh, library. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six mana, so we can actually deal this guy two. Guess we hope we don't die. Yep, 
coming down. Sure. Oh god. <clears throat> Must be nice. So oh, we make good one free card. All right, cool. Uh, three of those. Eldest. The devil. Probably just fight with fire. Good lord, was that an RDL? Uh, yep. Not not great. Mm, basically worse. Okay, so I guess we're just gonna mulligan to five here and then. Not get to play games. Sure. Well, that's gonna be a zero and we're at we go to seven and we go to six after this so basically just dead i like these positions that you get in where you're like oh well we don't have the things to deal with this so we're basically just dead We go to four, and then any two spells kill us. Sure. Well, let's see what the wind blows in. Here comes Chain Whirler. And now we just get, literally we're locked locked out of playing spells. That's so hilarious, dude. Oh god. Literally can't cast a spell. Oh, come on. Just want to peek. The weight is killing me. Yep. There's <sighs> nothing more soul sucking than playing against the deck like that.
We're gonna do one more because we, uh, eh, you can go to the bottom. We need things. Lands and things. I don't like this because it doesn't help us cast Absorb, but we're two lands away from casting Absorb anyway, so... second in response even though you're tapped up. Glad they didn't. Good for you. Good for you. Oh, they didn't have anything else. So we get to counter their next play and then Ritual of Soot if it's not something scary. I'll allow it. See you later. What are you at? Do we have two? No, oh, we got two. We're doing it. Come on, we're going for the 3 2 here. Goodbye, Ral. Well, they're in top tick mode, so I'm okay with it. I want to hit land drops. We can be whatever we, whatever audience we want. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That is a good point. Okay. Artifact, creature, or planeswalker. So you play this and try to hit a white source for absorb. We didn't, but we hit a land. I think we need one fewer blue red lands and one more white red lands. Oh, that's nice because we can get uh, the thing back. One, two, three, four. We take four though. Oh, God. That doesn't work at all. All right, I'm taking four here. We're going to one. Dislike. But we get a ritual of soot back. Well, that was that was good for us. I'm sorry. Why didn't it let me cast the bedevil at the end of the turn? Insight there too in round two, but I'd rather keep up 
Oh, guess I guess it probably didn't tap in such a way that we had double black. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four. We're just gonna have to play. Fight on you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we could captive and keep up absorb. have to deal with this guy they have five cards we have seven cards so we can actually play this and then play something for free one two and we have three we'd have absorb mana up and so now we have yeah Yeah, the main phase, the, I think we're being kept alive solely by the main phase Legion tokens. Because then we get to use things like Fight with Fire against them. But. Do you have two up? So we can. Yeah, that's fine. So that we're going to play for two. Okay, okay. I can't believe we're surviving at one life for this long. It's kind of unbelievable to me. so alive I don't understand so next time we get a free blocker which is nice that should keep us alive well, like we have to we have we have three turns worth of answers for this one one so okay God, heroic reinforcements would be just absolute butts right now. Yep, that's that's rough. Yeah, it doesn't matter which what are we going. And we get the city's blessing. Fantastic.
Okay, don't. Why are you having double red for this? God. Oh, we'd be dead like turns ago. Turns and turns ago. Actually, I don't think we even want to do this, right? We want to kill we want to kill this bird so we can get it back. Um oh uh, graveyard surprisingly because I think we're actually in a decent position here. Oh, we're not, we haven't even drawn our card yet? No, we have. Why didn't this flip? Oh, because we didn't have seven. Hmm, and that's something. I guess we can wait. Getting a healer's hawk with an Eldest Reborn. My god. Uh, graveyard. Transform. Fight with Fire. Uh, we have, we have a lot of mana. Okay, so what we can do... Let's do a little kickerino. One, two, three. Submit. Uh, seven to eight to you. One to you. One to you. Because if they play Heroic Reinforcements and we attack with this guy, they would actually have... No, well, we'd be dead now because of this. I forgot about this guy. So we're just basically trying to dodge a Heroic Reinforcements in a game that we should not be winning. Whew. Okay, we did it. <laughs> Woo! So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we can actually do this and keep up. Okay, finally. Whew. This, this is the longest game that we've ever had to survive for this long with no real reason to not be dead. If you know what I'm saying. Oh, I guess I was supposed to hit resolve. Last card, the top deck heroic reinforcements. I'm waiting for it. Go to six. That's all I've wanted.
No blocks. So if they do draw heroic reinforcements, they make a guy the heroic. They have eight on board. We can block one, kill one. We take four. Um, they're probably going to go to four here because giving us zombies is pretty bad. And I feel like once they give us zombies, the game is... All right. Wow. Wow. That... That that was a game. That was a game. Take out a sabotage. Take out a bedevil. Bring in another ritual. Deafening Clarion. Deafening Clarion. Take out one Marari Conjecture. Take out one Eldest Reborn. I'm gonna bring in two two bindings because they have their own bindings that I would like to get rid of. So we take out one bedevil. One of these. That's three, four. Oh, we bring in two rituals. We brought in two rituals. Let's see, we got one more card to cut. My god. I don't think we had any right to win that game. Also, just like we drew it up. Yeah, exactly. I'll keep this because we have a Clarion and Double Absorb, both of which are relevant in this matchup. We just need a second blue and a red source, so if we can draw like a Steam Vents. Or a Sulphur Falls, I'll take either one of those. What we don't want is an 8-drop, just keep that in mind. Sulphur Falls would be great because it turns on both, both of your boys. Knuckle Champ, someone literally just said that it's best of three. <laughs> oh, there you go. You figured it out. Ah, uh, yes. There you go. There you go. That's... We're halfway there. Living on a prayer. Taking five. You're making us swear. At least we can clarion on here. Oh my gosh, I was hoping they wouldn't do it. I was like, don't give don't give that dude indestructible. And they didn't. Well, we are not drawing lands. So that's pretty cool. So we're gonna take four or waste one of these. Maybe they're playing at no instant speed. So you can't activate any abilities at instant speed. Oh my god. 
Come on, deck. And we're holding steady. This is where they go heroic reinforcements. That's worse. So we're top to another Death Clarion. Oh, Godless Shrine. That is a thing. It is not a second blue. It only lets us so three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we actually can't we can't we can't actually cast this and cast this. I have a big spooter in my shower. He is my friend. I'm okay with it. Most of the time I let spiders, I just let him be. I'm like, yeah, you're good, man. We died. We did not win the game. Oh, I guess we're done here. I don't like this. I'm not having fun anymore. Something happened. Oh, for crying out loud. Well, at least we get to search on turn two, which is nice. That's why we kept that. Come on, Glacial Fortress on the top. It doesn't let us do anything, but we need lands. Ugh. Yeah, so we definitely need to fix the mana base just a little bit. This is problematic. They didn't do it last time. Do we think we'll do it this time? Probably not, right? Oh, don't do it. Why did you do it this time and not last time? Six, seven. It's awkward that it puts us to four exactly because if we draw a removal spell, uh, a sweeper. Just like top five cards not being land in a 26 land deck is so dumb. Like this, the, the client almost incentivizes you to play aggro decks because you never gonna hit your, if you play 26 lands, it doesn't matter. You're not going to hit your land drops. Yeah, it's game. We have one thing to do. All right. Two, three. Not the best. This deck was pretty sweet, though. We had game against all these other decks. I don't know if the, the mana base is my biggest issue towards... I feel like the games we lost, we had the biggest problem with mana. Yeah, great. Uncommon. Cool. Unplayable uncommon. Seems good. 
Let's move, how, what are our blue sources? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We need sixteen blue sources. I'm gonna I'm gonna write all this down. White. We only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm, I don't think that's enough. Black. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13. Red, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, okay, so we can definitely cut a blue source, a black source, and a red source. So blue, blue and anything else. So we can definitely add like a uh, cliff top retreat. Add one cliff top. So we're adding a a white, and we're taking out one of these. So we traded the blue for the white. So now we have 15 blue sources and nine white sources. We can also take out probably red. Like we only need we have like two red cards in the deck, don't we? Yeah, we have early red, I guess. I think our black is actually pretty heavily represented, but we have bedevil and ritual. The white man is rough, but like we need the life is a problem. Like the life gain is extremely relevant, uh, as we've seen by so many of those games. Actually, Diet, let's make sure I counted correctly. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's fifteen sources of blue. Okay, so red we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep. Black I have one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, what I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we definitely want a tenth source of white. So we're definitely gonna add one more hollowed fountain. For one probably one. So we added one more. So now we have 11, we have 10 and 16. So we're gonna take out a blue black probably. We take out one, one watery grave here. So we basically just traded a white for a black. So it's 10, 15, 13, 12 right now. I think we can go to 11, 11. So we wanna add another white source. And we wanna take out a red source. Which would mean like adding an isolated chapel maybe. So we're, we're adding a white source and we're taking out like a dragon skull summit. So now the black source stayed the same, which is 13. And now we have 11, 11. So we have 11 white sources, 15 black, so 15 blue sources, 13 black sources and 11 red sources, which I think is a lot better. I also feel like we can probably cut the mountain because the mountain is one of our actually cut the mountain for the dragon skull summit i think like these are our main colors island and swamp are the main colors they're the only colors we have double of double blue double blue double black double black everything else is just basically splashed here so and we took out the dragon skull summit four so now it's a 14th 14th black is this is this how many one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirty forty fifty six seventeen eight nine twenty two twenty five twenty six yeah, this is 27 lands. We actually have to cut one thing. I kind of just want to cut the island. How many check lands is this? Uh, a couple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten check lands, and how many? One, two, four, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 shocks. And then two basics right now. We can probably cut one shock land. Or probably cut one check land, I guess. We'll cut the Dragon Skull Summit. That's fine. Drops us down to 10, though, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, 
Yeah, I think we can cut a blue source. We can cut a blue, so go down to 14 and add a red. Which would be Dragon Skull Summit over, like, Watery Grave, I guess. Which is 11, 14, 13, 10. Or 11, 14, 13, 11. Which is good. I think that's fine. And that's probably what I'd go with for this deck. I think that's I think the deck is sweet. I actually like it a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it like that. Cut a glacial fortress. Um I don't want to cut a white source though. Yeah, I like having two basics, which is why we left that. Let me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That's still fifteen blue sources, actually. I wanted to go down to fourteen. <clears throat> I would sooner cut a hollowed fountain and add like another sacred foundry. I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to. We're just, we're just doing the mana base real quick and then we'll be done. So blue sources 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 blue sources. I like that. White sources we have 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so we have one too many white sources. Black sources, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Nope, that ain't right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so we need one more black source. And then red, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, well, we messed everything up now. Okay, so we need one fewer white sources, one more black source, and one fewer red sources. So we could take out, like, Sacred Foundry. And now we need one more black source and just whatever. Probably, like, a black-blue. I, I guess we would just go back to Drowned Catacomb at that point. Yeah, I think that's fine. So now it's 15, 13. So it's 11, 15, 14, 11, which is pretty good. I think that's probably the mana base that we want. Yeah, there's 14 black sources, 15 blue sources, and 11 white and red. Uh, you can show the deck stats, but the gold aren't broken down into their individual colors. So we have... You know, five black five black symbols, five black cards, I guess. Six red cards, which doesn't really tell you that much. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. If you haven't done so, check me out on Twitch and Patreon. Both of the links are in the description below. And if you want to have your own deck critique, definitely check me out on uh, both of those platforms. And there's information on how to do that. Um, but the otherwise, the deck list will be in the, in the description below. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. Hope, uh, hope you enjoyed.